Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Farm Manager 2018. This game is actually coming out on April 6th on Steam, but I've got early access to it, and it looks really freaking good. So let's go ahead and get into this. If you guys are curious about checking it out, you can check the link in the description to the Steam page. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this. We are going to be playing the campaign, and let's go ahead and just get started here. So, Chapter 1, Difficult Beginnings. Finally, you have arrived! See what this hurricane did to our family farm? I'm devastated. What shall I do now? Alone, with all this destroyed farm? I'm too old and too sick for such things. You know how mother loved this farm. I do not want to sell it to strangers. I know you've never wanted to be a farmer. However, please help me. Take care, take over the farm and help your old father. In the face of such tragedy, I do not even know where to start. Maybe our, from our roof repair on the house, we also need to remember about building new uh, manure storage. Ooh, who doesn't love some good old-fashioned manure storage? And a small warehouse. We have to get back on our feet somehow. So goals, we have to make a small warehouse, uh, manure storage, and fix the farm owner's house. Oh, wow. Yeah, we got riggedy riggedy wrecked. So, um, interesting. Let's see here. Oh, hello, is this me? Hey, I don't know if you remember me. I'm Adam. We went to school together. Your father asked me to help you a little on the farm and told me what to pay attention to. To begin with, can I show you where the most important things are? Yeah, sure, let's do it. Let's do it. This is one of the most important panels in the game. You should know it well. Okay. The bottom menu contains... Okay, so yeah, this is pretty standard. So this is going to have, like, all of our plants and stuff like that. After clicking this button, you will start creating a field. Okay. Is that... Do you want me to create a field? No, Okay. Ooh, we can make roads and stuff. Are we gonna make like a we we can actually it looks like a almost like a city simulator, but with a farm. Which is crazy. Not exactly sure how that's gonna work, but we will find out. Uh construction menu will find available farm buildings and decorative elements you can build into your farm. Interesting. What kind of stuff we got in here? Oh my god, it's all super expensive. What is this? Ooh, well equipped house for workers and employment. Okay, nice. Cool. Let's go ahead and just continue through this. This all seems pretty standard. Here you can hire new employees who are necessary not only for working the field, but also for caring for animals or working in factories. Pretty self-explanatory. Is this the stocks? <gasps> you refine all the necessary... In oh, wow. About the financial condition of your farm. Okay, easy enough. So we've got um, a training built... Oh, training. Wow. So agricultural machinery work. This is very in-depth. I'm gonna like this game. I really love city builders, and this is like, it's, it's cool. I think this is gonna be a nice, chill game to play. I hope you guys all enjoy it. Let's see here. You got economy. Okay, nice. Account history, debt payment. Okay, we can figure this all out as we go. Next. Uh, without machines working, the field is terribly tiresome, right? Yeah, so can we close out of this? It looks like the machinery is locked right now. Weather alert, too low temperature. That doesn't sound good. Uh, Mark, you can buy animals and feed. Got it. Here you can quickly check your stock status. Got it. Got it. Got it. I can figure this all out. <laughs> this Oh, we got $100,000. That's pretty good. We got money. In the top menu, will find important information. All right, so we got... What is this? By clicking this button, you can add a new resource ah, to the observed list. Oh, cow. I want to track me some cows. And we got fast forward. Got it. Okay, here you'll find information current date of the game. Too easy. Temperature. Cold as shit. This circle represents the season of the year. Ah, so we are going into spring right now. Very nice. I don't like that you have to... There's probably a way to adjust it, but I like being able to just click on the screen and then move, but maybe... Like, because I have a... How do I go left and right? Can I use... Okay, so we can use the keyboard for that. Uh, so maybe I'll tell you about the side menu. Side menu options are useful in the game. This looks pretty easy. Oh. Oh, we got a map. Very good. Use this button, you'll return to the main menu. Got it. Do you want to know more about the task panel? Nah, I think we're good. Learning fast. You need to go home now? Cool. All right, let me fix my stuff, dude. Oh, I clicked things. So interesting. Can I... Is there a way to, like, pan... So we can use WASD to move around. Ah, okay. Middle mouse button will let us move the camera around a little bit. This is pretty. I like this. So we need to repair all the things. If we click this building, we click this. Okay, so this just tells us everything about what we own. So we've got food here. Interesting. So lots and lots of stuff in here. So we're going to repair all of our buildings here. We've got this little repair button right here. If we click that, we should. Uh, it's not a good time. I have more important expenses. Interesting. Okay, so we're supposed to repair the house first. That's what we need to do. Oh! That's actually kind of cool to watch happen. Wow, look at that. 
There's one bug in here. It's gonna drive me crazy. It's not a farm in my house, ladies and gentlemen. But there is a bug in here. Pretending it. Oh, wow. We can get all... All up in there. Oh, this is actually really nice. Well, that's still all bork, 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 bork. Can you fix that? There's... I'm pretty sure there's not supposed to be holes in my house, guys. I paid a lot of money to fix this, and there's a big-ass hole right there. I don't know if you noticed that or not, but... <laughs> Windows are all sorts of broken as well. Alright, so... Let's see here. What else can we repair here? Alright, not too bad. We need a new storage thing, and we, we got a couple other things we gotta do, I guess, before we can repair some more stuff. What we need to do is we need a small storage area. And we also need a manure thingamabooper. So we got warehouses here. And we can build a small warehouse. I feel like having this close to the road is pretty imperative. So let's see here. I kind of want to put it maybe here. Or better yet. So it does need to connect to a road. So, so that way you can place it. And let's see here. Can we rotate this? What's a... Oh, I need to look at the controls. All right, so rotating stuff is relatively simple. I'm still getting used to the the way the mouse moves stuff around, but it's not bad. I couldn't find a way to fix that. But yeah, you use the little uh, bracket keys here to, to rotate stuff. Now I'm thinking this should probably just be a row of farms here. So I am just going to go ahead and put it next to the road. Although if we get super traffic, it might actually be an issue to put stuff here. Oh, bye tree. I kind of like that tree. I was hoping it would stay. All right, so... Right, that's probably just going to take some time to build here. Now let's go ahead and... I feel like we need more roads. Because we also need a manure thing, but I guess that's not really too crazy. Let's see here. How much space does this take up? And it does need to be attached to a road. Now we've got the cows there. Let's see here. I kind of feel like there should be a road going through here. Like right here. And then manure should probably be near the cows, I think. What is this thing? Oh, house for employees and stuff like that. Well, manure is going to be needed for the fields. So let's go ahead and do this. I've got an idea. I'm an idea, man. So paver road. Let's just go ahead and make a road like this. There we go. And then we'll attach some stuff right to this thing. Yeah, like so. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Got our manure storage. Yes, yeah, so we can't put it too close. Alright, so, now what does this do? Do I have to actually, like... Maybe just time needs to be sped up, maybe? Is what I'm thinking. So let's just go do this, see what happens. Okay, yeah, so time just needed to be sped up a little bit. Oh, it's so cool to watch it build like that. Oh, so that actually delivered all the supplies and stuff. Oh, that is cool! Let's see, let's speed up time really fast. See, how, see what happens. So this car is dropping off all the supplies. Oh, that's super in-depth. That's amazing. I like this game already. I haven't played a lot of it, but uh, if you guys want to see more of this channel, let's see if we can get this video to 100 likes. If we can get every video to 100 likes, I will continue playing this. How's that sound? Let's do it. You guys can do it. I believe in you. Chapter 1 Difficult Beginnings is complete. Thank you. At least now it will not rain on our heads. First of all, you still need to fix the house for workers, despite the remaining damages. Okay, so I don't think I need to read all this, but we have goals here. We've got to create a um, a one by field. Okay, so one hectare or something like that. Plow field, cultivate field, fertilize field. Buy 79 units of strawberries. Ooh, we're going to make some strawberries, plant strawberries, fix the house for current employees. Too easy. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead I don't know if we're going to actually get so in-depth where we need to rotate fields and stuff like that, but I imagine probably. So we've got... Gr Do we just really have a grass field of grass? Okay. Whatevs. All right, so let's make this a field here. And I'm going to... Maybe I should make a road in between. I don't exactly know how everything works yet, but I'm going to feel like having proper ways to get to everything is going to be beneficial in the long run. So we're just going to put roads in between all of our fields right now. For now. At least until we figure out if we run out of space or not. So that's 1,600. Let's go ahead and make it... Alright, so this is big enough. I think. Hold on, before we get too crazy, it should say create a field... Okay, so it just needs to be point or a 0 0.1. And we were definitely over that for this particular field. I don't know if we really need that many strawberries. Maybe what we'll do is 
We'll make... We'll cut it in half, like this. And we'll put strawberries here. And then we can plant another smaller crop down below. I imagine having a variety of crops is probably good. Bet with a neighbor. Prove you're faster and produce nine times cow milk before to win eight... Whoa! That's cool. <gasps> that is that is freaking amazing, actually. There's so much stuff! Oh, this is exciting. Anyways, alright, sorry. I'm losing my mind. What is this? Produce nine... Oh, so we actually won that bet. Oh, okay. We got monies. Hell yeah. I ain't gonna complain about that. Let's slow shit down here just a little bit here until I figure out exactly what we're doing. So now we gotta plow the field. How does one do that? How does one plow a field? So I'm imagining here... Oh, no, that's the demolish button. Oh, God. That's super easy. So you just click on the field, and you can select everything that you need to do. So let's go ahead. Uh, plowing. So we got to assign somebody to do that. So let's go ahead and do that. Accept. Okay. And then we have to wait until she's done, and then we can assign a new project to that. So let's go ahead and repair the worker's house real quick. I'm assuming it doesn't want us to do this yet because of the campaign. Got it. That does not look very repaired. My house still looks all sorts of jacked up, too. We'll just leave it like it for now, though. Look at our cows. Can I get another cow? <gasps> I can get another cow. Animals in the building, two out of six. Buy cow. Sure. I lost money. I do not have a third cow. And maybe it takes time. Maybe my cow needs to be delivered. What's that? Is that my cow? I swear, if they actually have to deliver the cow, that's going to be so cool. I think they do. That's my cow! <gasps> that's so cool! Oh, we're going to call you Betty. Betty the cow, or Bessie, or Big Therma. Are you a female cow? I mean, probably. That is so cool! Oh, man, that's amazing! All right, I, I love this game already. All right, you are plowing, plowing like nobody's ever plowed before. All right, so we've got this field of grass. Now, this is a perennial plant, and I don't know if this is like the health of it, but we've got the cultivation is fully green, so crop quality is really high. So I'm feeling like maybe we should cultivate it. Right? I don't even know. I'm going to go with yes. So let's see here. What is this stat? The skill of managing orchards affects the size of the harvest in the orchards. Uh, plants affected the size of the harvest. So two out of five. She's not great for this. Well, Sherry, you're all I got. So Sherry's going to have to do us a solid here and take care of business. All right. We'll see what happens. We need to buy strawberry seeds. And we needed how many did we need? We need 79 units of strawberry seeds. So that's not too bad. We got cherries. We got all sorts of stuff. And it even has like market prices and stuff like that. So you can actually check... And, and buy stuff when it's like really low price or you could probably even buy stuff when it's low and then sell it when it's high and make money that way as well which is pretty cool so we can actually search for we got strawberry here so we need strawberry seedlings right strawberry seedlings there we go and of course they're expensive right now we need uh, 79 units of these bad boys they're cheap at least I probably could have just typed that in there we go Growth time takes 50 days to, buy, to to grow those bad boys. So all we need to do now is fertilize, cultivate, and plow. Okay. Seems easy enough. Snap, she's almost done. It's a Christmas miracle. Only a little bit more. I hired on two new employees. I wish we could put more people on each of the crops. There might be a way to... I could probably do it if I interrupted it. Um, but what we're going to do here now is we're going to slow down time a little bit here. So now we need to cultivate fields. So it looks like we're cultivating this field, and that's probably what it means. Um, so we'll just go ahead and plant... Ah, for, we got to fertilize this field. So we can put more people to work this time doing this. So we can interrupt the work and then add more people. So that's why I hired on more people. And um, wait, is that too many people? Wait, can we only do one at a time? Wait. Interesting. Autofill? Why can't I accept it? Ah, I gotta choose the... Let's okay. Oh, so we've got lots of manure. There we go. Bam. Helps if you pay attention to things. Alright, so what do we got going on here? We got our cows doing pretty good. I wish I could make this look a little bit better. It still looks like things are... 
Okay, now this looks good. Why does my house still look like hammered butt? This this was looking dilapidated not too long ago. Maybe it's just still slowly repairing, I guess. It's not like I can No, it's not in good time. I have Okay, so maybe it's just not repaired enough, I guess. Interesting. Definitely having all three working on that at once made it super duper easy to do that. So what is I, it keeps telling me like I need to cultivate it first. But we're cultivating this field, so I'm hoping that's what it means. Uh, so let's go ahead and plant plant the seeds in there. Unless, let me see what happens when I do this. Just just out of curiosity, for curiosity's sake, see what happens. See, that doesn't seem right. Well, it's going up, so that's good. But crop quality is going down. Oh, no, it's going up. Okay, so that's good. So that's we did need to do that first. We're good to go. Yeah, we're good to go. Plant some mag... Oh, wait. Wait. It looks like it's good to go. We got everything, like, perfect for these strawberries. Ah, there we go. Nice. Perfect. So let's go ahead and plant some magnificent... Ooh, we can plant apple trees. Oh, we don't have any of that stuff. Okay. Uh, I can just search for strawberry. Strawberry seedling. I thought I... Hey, what? Strawberry seedling. I, I've got a whole bunch, I thought. Yeah, I bought a whole bunch. Where are they? Are they in the warehouse? No. Are they here? No. Somebody done stole my strawberries. Oh, hell no. All right, so... <laughs> what is this? All right, we'll buy 248 units. You need 248 units? That's true. Okay, we'll do it. Oh, I need to buy it. Oh, my God. Strawberries are being planted. I'm getting the hang of it. Uh, so we're planting all 248 units of strawberries. So we're planting more than what the campaign requested of us. So we should be pretty good to go. Oh, look at these. These are going to end up being pretty big, eh? I suppose. So, ah, uh, there we go. So I, w I accidentally cultivated it. I needed to harvest it not cultivate it so i made a big ass mistake doing that um so i'm hoping this grass mate might spread because i need did i just sell how did i just did i just lose all that milk because i didn't sell it <gasps> oh no that was like a thousand units of milk that was like a couple grand oh my goodness all right so things i think do expire because if we click on oh oh we did it we're we're winning you still have to water the field. To do this, put a well next to the field so that workers can easily get water. So one well and watering the field. Okay, so let's slow down time. Yeah, so I think this is the date that we have until it goes bad. So like uh, August 27th is when it's going to go bad. The silage... I don't even know. So the seedlings will be good until June 16th. Manure, 2032. So I got to pay attention to that. I need to make sure to sell things before they actually expire. All right, anyways, so we need a, um, a water thingy, right? Others? There we go. A well? That seems like a really inefficient way to be watering things, but who am I to complain? So I'm wondering if I'm going to be doing another crop here. I, can't, I, sh I feel like I should put water there so I don't have to walk so far. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put it. We're gonna put it right there. There we go. And then we gotta water this bad boy. We're gonna just keep hiring all three so that we can get it nice and quick. Like, it feels like a good way to do it. I don't know. I might be blowing through a lot of money this way. We will find out. What do we got here? Recent years, the price of silage has increased significantly, and our cows are less and less profitable. We have never produced silage before on our farm. So you'll have to build a silage storage. It'll take a while, so you better do it right now. Okay, so we got to build one silage storage and fixed, uh, fix small cow shed. Okay, so seems pretty straightforward. Let's go ahead and pause this. Is this telling us to gather this now? I think that's what that is. So let's go ahead and do this. We'll put these guys to work here. Gather up all these things. we got to train one worker to max level. Which, um, how do we do that? So, let's see here. If we go here, can we... Do we train this way? 
Ah. Endurance, so I can upgrade this to more endurance. And achievement unlocked. Nice. Train any worker to max level. Sweet. We did it. And we got a whole bunch of money. I think we made back probably the same amount of money we spent on that, but it's going to be good anyways. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, snap. All sorts of crazy stuff going on over there. So let's go ahead and repair this bad boy. Bam! Oh, that was expensive. It's so cool how all this works, though. Oh, you put the wood in the cow! It just killed Bessie. Or Bertha. What did we name it? I don't even remember. Anyways, we need a storage warehouse. Wait, what? What, 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 what? Uh, we need to build. There we go. Build a storage. We need a silo. Where art thou, silo? Ah, so this is pretty cool. What we can do is... Where'd it go? I lost it. I lost it. There it is. So a storage for silage. But this you can process straw, crops, and hay into silage. So very cool. I think what we're going to do is we're going to continue pretty much leaving this little area as storage for all of our things, right? It seems like a good idea. And we fixed the small cow shed where we're working on it. And we're building our silage. So pretty cool. How's our crops doing here? That all looks good. It's been watered. Uh, soil humidity. So this might need to be watered again soon. We'll probably wait till it gets to about here. And we'll water it again. What's going on here? All right, so we've got 20 kilograms of grass left. Oh, 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 there we go. Nice. So chapter one. The landfill was built. Now you will be able to process grass into silage. Our cows cannot wait any longer. They love it for its juiciness. Do not forget to repair the barn. Yeah, we did that again. So produce two units of silage. Fix the barn. Ah, got it. Okay, so this is the barn. Go ahead and hammer this bad boy up. $2,000 to do that. And we need to staff this. Which I feel like we should probably put one of these dudes down there. Uh, you know what? We'll hire a new employee for this. We might be going a little crazy with the employees, but I want a, a strong person. We need somebody with good, with a good physique. I don't think there is any left, actually. Where's this guy? This guy's good with bees. All right, we don't care about that. We need... Okay, we don't have any machinery, so it wouldn't make any... Ah, there we go. Caddy Rose, you are hired, girl. You're going to be working our our poo pit. <laughs> or our silage, rather. <laughs> oh, there we go. So $10 a month to run that. And then... Is this how much a day it is, I think? Or a month? Who knows? I have no idea. Anyways, we're kind of just going with the flow. But all things considered, I'm really enjoying this game. It's super in-depth, which I love. Oh my god, where's all my money going? I just spelt... Spelt... Spent... That was a lot of money. Oh my goodness, that must have been for all the workers. That was a buttload of money. Okay, so we've got until the 25th before this goes bad. Uh, June 25th, it looks like. Let's go ahead and sell it. So we can do that now. Oh my god, milk is tanking! Oh no! Oh, we're gonna sell a hundred. Oh, I'm only $200. Oh god. Oh, we need more milk. We need more cows is what we need. I'm so sad that I missed that thousand units of freaking milk. Oh my goodness. So how's our grass doing? Good, good. We've got some silage left. All right, so we need to create silage. Let's see here. We're going to use the grass for that. Take above. Is that what I want to do? Just infinite? There we go. So I just want to convert all of my grass into silage, I guess. I imagine that's probably how that's going to work. We'll f I guess we'll find out as we go. That seems right. I don't know. We'll go with it. All right, so I think we're doing, what's this? Uh, so we need to produce that much silage. Interesting. So it kind of looks like they're laying it all up to be baled. Are they going to hand bale all this stuff? That seems like it's going to suck. But kind of, because we got a, another line here. And this is what you, when you do when you're actually, you know, baling hay and stuff like that. It gets put into lines, like machines will do that. And then it'll go through like a baler and stuff like that, which is 
A lot more effective than doing it by hand. You guys are crazy. I imagine that's what's going to happen here in a second, though. Or we'll have an option to tell them to bail it. Oh, oh no, they're ba Oh, they're bagging it. Putting it into bags. All right. Now we should start seeing our grass kilograms go up once they go into the into the thing. Ah, yep, we're at 90 now. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Okay, so that's good. I was curious because it took forever. Like, we didn't... We weren't, like, putting anything in. They were just chopping it down for a long period of time. But now that they're actually bagging it, everything seems to be pretty good now. Your animals are sick! What? What happened? Oh, no. $500 for the vet? Oh, my goodness. Oh, vet, where are you? Is that you? I bet that's it right there. Oh, Bessie got sick. There's the vet. No. No. Oh, my goodness. Wait, is this the vet? Somebody's here. Okay, cow is better. Nice. Thank you, vet. Bye. Okay. I don't know. Probably stuck his thumb up its butt or something like that. Ready? <gasps> we can breed? Okay, we gotta slow down time here. Alright, show. <laughs> oh, it's on. Bounce bow bow. Making some cow babies. Oh yeah. Nothing like some good insemin oh come back. Where's our inseminator? The inseminator's here. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Oh, our cows just multiply like crazy all of a sudden. <laughs> the senator just came, touched its butt, and we're good to go. That was weird. That was funny. Okay, well, we got more cows, which means more milk, which means we also, you know, have a requirement for more food. So, let's see here. Okay, so the grass, I think, is just... Is it just regrowing on its own? I think it is. So let's water this bad boy. Uh, yeah, we'll just use... Oh, uh, yeah, Mr. Rogers, sure, whatever. Uh, we'll just accept that. We'll leave one person going. Ah, there we go. Now we're getting our silage going. Perfect. Perfect. You know what? Let's do 100%. There we go. We're good to go. Good to go. Ooh, nice. Milk has gone up quite a bit. So we're going to go ahead and sell out all of the milk that we have. So we're getting about 1600 bucks, which is not too bad. We tanked the price doing that a little bit, but... All in all, things are going pretty well. There's like quite a little bit of micromanaging to it, which if you like that, you're definitely going to like this. We got our two units of silage. Um, so yeah, now we're on to chapter two, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. I actually quite like this this game. It's really nice just to kind of relax and play. I don't know. I'm in love with it. This so far, really, really good. Lots of stuff to do, very in-depth, and I cannot wait to see where the rest of this campaign goes. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Remember, if you do want to see more of this on the channel, don't forget to share your support and smash that like button. It really helps. You guys have no idea. Share it with your friends and family. Every single share, regardless even if it gets views, really helps out. Let's see if we can get this video to at least 100 likes. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye!